I've seen this beautiful young lady, and I know y'all tell y'all that a lot. And I was like, wow, who is that? I said, I told my camera guy, take a picture of her. Turns out, I just seen a random beautiful woman, and ladies and gentlemen, Tara from Love and Hip Hop, New York. How you doing? I'm well, how you doing? That was a very sweet introduction, by the way. Like, you're like, I was like following you there, like you just set me up. I'm like, wow, wow, where was she? Who was she? That's amazing. Aww. Well, you know what it is? It's, 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 it's when, when I'm a fan, I'm a fan of people. And, you know, beyond where we go in regards to the whole television and things or whatever, I like to see rawness of people, the real part of it. So, for me to see you look the way you did, ladies and gentlemen, just, just see what I'm going from here. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. All right. Give him a little sachet of what's going on here, because I don't think these people. Yeah. Oh. All right. Okay. Yeah. Now you're making me really sad. Now, nah, yes, now. So I just need to let y'all know. Now I told her, and that's just what I said. But I said she was a better-looking version of Olivia. Now Olivia's. I said Olivia is absolutely gorgeous, beautiful. So I'm feeling really good about myself if you compare me to her. She did say that. So yeah. Olivia, she wasn't putting it down. I kind of, I, I kind of downgraded. Her. No, I love Olivia. She's beautiful and uh, and a sweetheart. That's what I love most. I like when her hair's to the side, where she has that little like mohawk type of thing going on. I don't know what her hair's looking like now. But. Every time I see her, she just like reinvents herself, and and she's always different. Her hair is always different, and she looks just as beautiful. Like it's never like, why did she wear that? I think she's always beautiful. I think you gotta be. You heard that exclusive. You don't ask the thing without all. Thank you, thank you. She's very humble with it, but you know, what's going on? I mean, how is everything going with, you know, the show? Are you coming back? Tell everybody what's going on with 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 the drama. <laughs> the drama. Well, in, in terms of next season, you have to stay tuned. Okay. You know what I mean? That's something that we're all anticipating and hoping for. Okay. Um, you know, last season, I just want to take a break, you know, move on, clear my head. Um, start exploring options for myself. I'm an actress, start getting back into acting. You are, but you said that you was an actress on the show. Yes. I remember yes. that. Yes, yes. Uh, you know, I studied acting for many years. I was acting, pursuing that for a little while. And then, you know, I started my family. So now it's something that I'm just going back into or getting back on the right track of or start in, and studying again. Now this is great. So, she's talented, by the way, ladies and gentlemen. Now, where, where, where does this go from here now? Is it is it a thing of, a lot of people don't know, are you and Peter Guns together, what's going on? Give them basically the PG version of exactly what they need to know. Well, this is what happened. No, I'm kidding. Um, <laughs> you, know, you know, Peter and I have two children, so we will always be connected, always be together in some light because we have two children. But right now we're co-parenting and that's working for us. Well, see, I always like the guests to say what they got to say. Because here's a, a humble young lady that people almost didn't even feel that she represented the show only because she was so classy. So she has such a classy appearance. And knowing that this is live, and I interviewed a lot of people, so I'm just letting you know that you have a lot of fans out there because the ladies that watch the show, which is a lot of ladies, not women, ladies, that's a strong word. You're representing for the ladies, so to speak, because you kept yourself in a real classy manner. So we just want to say we appreciate you, and we hope to see you next season. And is anybody, anybody going to get their eye punched out from you? <laughs> I hope not, unless I black out again. <laughs> now. No, no, no. I don't condone violence. No, no, no. She's not violent. So ladies and gentlemen, just remember that there is class, regardless of what goes on in these reality shows, it's real. And there's a lot more things going on in your personal lives than it is probably in her life. So don't sit there and be judging nobody like, I wouldn't have did this and did that. Okay, us guys are tough. Okay? Yeah. We are a handful. Uh, uh, two handfuls. Three sometimes. <laughs> you need all hands and all feet involved. <laughs> yes, we do. So now, we, we want to make sure that we're going to see you at Brooklyn. Give them a sachet of what's going on here. This, this is... I, I'm like, I always wear black. I, I'm always in black. This is like, you know, me trying to get dressed in the last minute. So, I'm glad you like it. I'm, I'm, I appreciate that. I'm, I'm, I appreciate it because I, I like accessories. We see the little thing going on here. This is great. See, this is called coordination. You see, this is a, a ring that didn't fit. But, and so was, I just, was that a ring from uh, 
from a jeweler, Donnie Michaels, and she's amazing. She's, she's She always keeps me blinged out. I like that. <laughs> and uh, who, who does the hair? Uh, the hair of my extensions. That's a line that I'm an ambassador for. Uh, my extensions is out of Chicago. I love them, a great hairline. You guys should all check it out. My extensions with a Z at the end. And promo code Tara for a great discount on that. And um, check it out, yeah. Actionthingu.org is more than just a lifestyle, and she smells great too. Oh, thank you. Tom Boy. <laughs> Actionthingu.org. <laughs> 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 <laughs>